Okay, so money is a new thing to have to, well, purchase those SDUs, weapons, ammo, health, slot machines, basically everything. Money is key, so having an easy way to get money would be a great thing. Today, guys, that's exactly what I bring you. How's it going, guys? My name's DPJ, and I'd like to thank you for stopping by and checking out my video. If you do enjoy it, leaving a like truly helps out, and subscribe if you want to see more. Okay, so money in Borderlands 3 is used for way more things than what it was for in previous games. So if there was a way of farming money, so to speak, a way of getting money super easy, you'd want to know how. Well, that's what I bring you today. Okay, so this will be a lot easier for you if you have what I believe is the pre-order gold weapon skins, which you also get via purchasing the deluxe or super deluxe editions of the game. If you haven't, this is still possible but it will take a lot of luck on your behalf in the sense you'll need to find a certain item okay so for those with the gold weapon skin pack once you have claimed them via the mail social tab you will bag yourself a grenade called the rubber cheddar shredder one of its benefits is to make it rain enemies drop a holy metric buttload of cash when damaged and damn people they do indeed drop a rack of cash for you to collect now me being an idiot that on my first character I actually didn't read that small print and got rid of this item due to its level being below mine. So I had to create another character to snag this which works by the way. So if you accidentally get rid of one of your pre-order or special edition items you can create another character and get them back. Then if you want to use said items such as this grenade on your main have a pal invite you to his game on your character that you've just created which will have said items. Drop the item for them, leave that game, load up your main character then join back and collect that loot. So having this grenade equipped, all you have to do is land shot on enemies. Now if you know a place where multiple enemies spawn and gather together, you are good to go and farm that money. A place I have been using which is incredible is Mouthpiece, one of the first bosses you encounter within the Ascension Bluff area. Now what makes this place great is the fact that there are plenty of loot boxes for you to get them grenades from right before the boss encounter and even within the boss encounter the enemies are endless and there are loads of loot boxes all over the place. So it's basically a constant flow of grenades and money and you rack up thousands in minutes people and the best thing about this is guys there is a save point right outside this place so when you think you farmed enough and don't want to carry on to beat the boss or you want to reset because the boss his health is low and you don't want to kill him simply quit out and reload back up your game you respawn right outside this boss room encounter ready to stop back up on all those grenades and start the process again now the grenades are pretty tricky to land because they bounce but if you land a direct impact they will explode but I'm pretty sure you actually get more money if you they bounce first and hit an enemy. I was trying to bank shot some off the wall to make them come back and hit the boss and it seemed as though I was getting more money but that's a test for another video. Now these grenades are not limited though to the pre-order and special editions you can find these grenades in game which offer this special perk. But that will take a little luck. So if you come across any grenades and want to do this, read the small print people. So yeah, people, obviously the main thing we will be purchasing as we further on progress into the game are SDUs. And you need money for that. And this is the perfect spot, the perfect farm for that. So farm that money, purchase those SDUs, and you are good to go. But on that note, we have come to the end. Guys, if you enjoyed the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you are new around here and want to see more Borderlands 3 videos, be sure to subscribe. And if you never want to miss a video I upload, you can turn notifications on by hitting that bell button. But guys, thanks as always for stopping by. Hopefully you enjoyed the video and hopefully I will see you on that next one.